former President Donald Trump is rallying in Battleground, Wisconsin. As the race of the White House heats up, Trump spoke in the heat. Our political reporter Jason Calvi is there in the scene with what the former president had to say. Jason? Well, he just wrapped up a few moments ago here as the White House is on the line. This is one of those key battleground states that's really going to help decide who wins the White House this fall. The last two presidential elections right here in Wisconsin decided by less than one percentage point, some 20,000 votes separating the winner from the loser. So former President Donald Trump comes right here to Festival Park in Racine on the shores of Lake Michigan. The wind off the lake and cloud coverage is making it quite comfortable right now. Crowds of hundreds lined up all morning to get inside. Mr. Trump criticized President and Biden on the economy and the border. He said he'd, he said that former President Trump said he'd prevent World War III. He said he was opposed to transgender sports. This is his first visit to the state since he was convicted in the hush money case and less than a month from the Republican National Convention in Milwaukee. Today he started his speech about the reports he called Milwaukee a quote, horrible city. Republicans in that private meeting said those words were taken out of context. Here's what the former president said to his supporters here in Racine. I was the one that picked Milwaukee, I have to tell you. I was the one that picked it. These lying people that they say, oh, he doesn't like Milwaukee. I love Milwaukee. I said, you got to fix the crime. We all know that. You got to make sure the election's honest. But I'm the one that picked Milwaukee. So the RNC actually picked Milwaukee back in the summer of 2022. Former President Donald Trump then launched his campaign for president later that year, some three months after the RNC picked Milwaukee. We're live here in Racine. Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. Recently at Trump rallies in Arizona and uh, in uh, Nevada, there were people who succumbed to the heat. Any problems today? It's a scorcher out there. Well, it is a scorcher, but you got to remember we're just feet from Lake Michigan. We've been having this cool breeze coming right off of the lake. And so even though it is a scorcher in much of our region right here with even though that we've got a lot of cloud coverage, we've had cloud coverage throughout the day and that that breeze from Lake Michigan has made things a little bit more comfortable. I haven't seen any problems of people passing out. Good to hear that. Jason Calvi reporting. Thank you. Now, ahead of Trump's visit to Racine, the Democratic Party of Wisconsin Chair Ben Winkler put out a statement that reads in part, in contrast to Donald Trump's insults and broken promises to the people of Wisconsin, President Biden and Governor Evers have delivered for Racine and southeastern Wisconsin with a $3.3 billion investment by Microsoft in new data centers already under construction on the site of Trump's Foxconn failure. We'll have the full statement on fox6now.com.